Hi everybody, it's your girl B. Hi. Um, I haven't talked to you guys in a long, long, long time. It's been months actually, probably like four months. Um, I just want you to know that I'm doing great. God has been blessing me. You know, God is awesome. He's my provider. He's my rock. He's my everything. And I am here to testify to you right now that if you're going through something, just hold on because God wants something better for you. If you tried and tried and tried everything you know how to do, hold on because God has, he wants what's best for you. And I am a witness here to tell you that God, he is so awesome. So awesome. And, uh, yeah. So with that being said, guys, um, God has been blessing me. He's been raining down for me and my family. My children are doing excellent in school. My baby girl's doing good in daycare. I'm doing wonderful at my new job. I barely do anything and get paid good. Um, my husband, of course, is doing good at his new job. Um, what else? Uh, just, just things have been going good. Um, of course, you know, you're going to come um, for everybody who thinks that um, being a Christian is all roses. You're not going to never go through nothing. That's a lie. You're going to go through things, and you're not going to be perfect. I'm not perfect. I still curse. I curse up a storm. But, you know, it's okay because me and God are here. We're here. So if you hear me cuss, please forgive me. I'm working on that. But, you know, I have a relationship with God. I know what he can do for me. I know where he took me from, and I know where he's going to take me. So without, <laughs> with that being said, I'm not going to preach anymore. But God has uh, definitely been blessing me, me and my family. So, yeah. Um, where to start, you guys? Where to start? Um, I gotta do a video about this Remy hair, Remy, or Brazilian hair that I purchased like two months ago. Two months ago, or um, two months ago. Yeah, as you can see, it's not in my head anywhere because I got jib. I got off eBay. Um, I will do a video on that. Um, a whole nother video, I'll show you the hair, I'll show you where I got it, and my leftover hair. I spent a lot of money on that hair, and for it to be bogus hair, I was so disappointed. I mean, don't get me wrong, it held up after I dyed it. Um, it just, I had to wash it every week. This is even before I dyed it, mind you. I had to wash it every week, unless it would be nasty looking. It would look like I have a infested I don't know, I guess birds nest in my head, I don't know, just nasty, and I can't go to work looking like that, you know, anyway, so I took it out, I did this uh, synthetic uh, quick weave that I done, um, it's okay, I'm going to take it out, anyway, and my birthday is on Saturday, uh, well, Sunday, I'm going to be celebrating on Saturday, so I will be doing a birthday video with a birthday outfit, me looking all hot, but anyway, so yeah, um, what else? Uh, there's so much stuff. Like, me and my husband definitely seeing our goals and buying our house. You guys are going to be with me for all of that. Um, school, me and my husband start trying to start our own business. Come in January, I get more into that. I do a video on that as well. Um, so much. It's so much. I haven't talked to you guys in a long time. So much. I was going through a situation last week, but I handled it. Um, I briefly, really quick, I feel like friends should be able to say anything to friends. If you're a friend, if you're my friend, I'm be, I should be able to say anything to you. If you made me feel the type of way, I should be able to say, you know, we're grown. I didn't appreciate it, and you should be able to say the same thing to me. So you ladies let me know how you feel about that. Should friends be able to say anything to each other um let me know what you think about that thank you to all my new subscribers all three of you thank you so much even though i have not been doing videos i have not been up here talking rambling doing crazy stuff thank you for subscribing to my channel thank you so much that was so that was good for my soul that was good for my spirit um what else? Oh, I, I don't know if I told you about my church that I found me and my husband found. We love the church, but we haven't been going. We, we've been in that church for like a month or two. Because I started working, I know this is so terrible. But um, 
well, I have church in my heart. I have God in my heart, you know. But um, we're we're gonna go back. We're gonna go back. Um, what else? What else? Can I tell you? It's, oh, it's so good to see you guys. I know I can't see you, but you can see me. Um, I'm working on losing weight. Um, me and my husband were doing insanity, but I stopped doing it because I can't do it and go to work and like. Guys, my day is so full. I barely have time to break. When I get home from work, come home, cook, get kids, I mean, do my daughter's homework, get kids a bath. Then after that, time for me to get myself together, wash dishes, blah, blah, blah. You get what I'm saying. I barely have time to think. So that's why I'm glad now I got my work scheduled. Now I can come to you guys on the regular. And yeah, you know, no more training, no more tests, no more studying. I am working. Well, I've been working, but I was getting paid to train basically so i'm out of that and i'm thanking god because that was the most excruciating piece of mess ever but i'm thankful so i took it in stride um what else what else um god has just been awesome y'all he's been awesome he's been working with me my children my husband i mean i, got, I still got ways to go i got probably mountains to climb so, but you know, I'm still here, and I'm. But for real, for real, like I, I tell people, like as Christians, you, you're not gonna do everything perfect. You, you, it's always a strive. You're always working on yourself daily. It's a daily thing. Give and take, give and take, give and take. Working on yourself. So me, I have a filthy, filthy potty mouth. I'm working on my filthy potty mouth, but it's gonna come out. I curse really bad, like really, really bad, and I know this. Um. But God knows. He knows my heart. He knows my heart. He knows me. We have a relationship. We're like this, actually. Yeah, that is my father. Um, and of course, I don't know. It's so much, you guys. Um, this hair is actually red. It's not good in this light, but it's really pretty. Uh, what else? I guess that's it. I don't know. But I will be coming to you guys with more big busted videos now that I have time to actually do. Actually, I had a really cute outfit on yesterday that would look good on big busted women. But um, yeah, so I'm definitely gonna um, do some more of those videos. And I guess that's it, you guys. Um, to, just to tell you that I'm back. I am back. I am back. I am back and full in effect. And yeah. You guys be on the lookout for more videos. I I will definitely do one before this week is out. Um, I think I'm gonna go ahead and do a big busting video and follow up with the actual eBay hair. I will be showing you the seller and I will be putting warning signs up. Warning: Do not purchase hair because hair is obviously fake. Well, it's not. I'm not gonna even say it's fake. I believe it's real, but I don't believe it was Brazilian hair. Maybe it was Brazilian mixed with something else, but it was not 100% virgin Remy hair. And that's what the website said. So, yeah. You got, I mean, why do I keep saying virgin Remy hair? 100% Brazilian hair. So, yeah, that's, that's not what I got. Maybe I got, maybe I did get Remy hair. I don't know. But I, it was in Brazilian what I got. So we will talk about that later. Um, I will not be doing um, any catch up videos or outfits that I brought or anything like that because I brought so much stuff since I've been doing videos. I mean, since I stopped doing videos, it's ridiculous. I will never go back and try to do all that stuff. But I will do outfit of, of the days and you can see some things, some new things. And if you guys have any questions for me, definitely hit me below and I will answer them. And you know, just, if you're going through something, God is going to take care of you. Just, just be patient. And if you're a good person, oh, you're going to be blessed. So just hold on. It's okay. I've been through a lot. You can ask me anything from mother in law issues to friendship issues to husband issues through. That's their issues and things. You can ask me. Ask me how how I approach it or what do you think? I, I'm here. And I, I can tell you from a Christian point of view. I can tell you from a struggling Christian point of view as well. So, you know, definitely hit me below and 
real chat. So you guys be blessed as always. Like, comment, and subscribe, and be blessed. Bye bye. Mm -hmm. If I can get the screen off. <laughs> bye bye.